Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today we're back at the Disneyland Resort. Today is Tuesday, which means pin release day. Oh, I forgot to mention we have a reservation for Disneyland. So that's where we're headed today. So it's currently 8.45 in the morning and here's how it looks to enter the park. It's not bad. And about a minute later and we're inside the park now. It is a beautiful day here at the park today. Also, check out Minnie, or wait. It's no longer Minnie Mouse. Look, it's been transformed back into Mickey. So I'm a little bit bummed out. We missed the characters at the train station. <laughs> but anyways, I think we're gonna head to the Emporium to see if there's anything new. So we just got inside of the Emporium and it looks like they got that Duplo set that I showed you guys last week. This one's $99.99. Over here near the ear wall, looks like there's a new pair of ears. Check these out. These are, yeah, Enchanted Tiki Room ears. These are cool. Look, there's a Dolip. Right there in the middle. The ears are pretty well made. I feel like the, the ears can be a little flimsy, they feel like. But, I don't know. The quality is there, though, I think. These are... It didn't say, so most likely the $34.99. So those ears are really nice, but what's cooler than one new pair of ears? Two new pair of ears. So here, next to the ear wall still, they have the Simba and Mala ears. These are pretty cool. Look how puffy those ears are. <laughs> That's on the sides. It feels like a like a canvas bag or something. It feels nice. These ears are nice. Just like the last pair of ears I showed you guys, it doesn't like the prices on there, so I'm gonna guess and say that they're $34.99. But besides the two new ears, it looks like they also have a new Loki hat. This was definitely not here the last time I was here. I mean, the hat's cool, but I'm not a fan of the style of the hat. But if this is your style, this one's $29.99. And then still by the ear wall on this little display right here, looks like they have a new hat as well, which is Simba. This is a kid's hat. Uh, this one's $24.99. So over like in the next room where they have like the pins and all that, there's two new shirts. Here's a look at the two new shirts. Let me show you guys this one first. It's the castle with a rainbow going over it. This one's pretty cool. And then the shirt itself, it looks like it's like a teal. I thought it was green a little bit because like in the in the shadows it looks green, but when you put it to the light, it looks kind of tealish. I think this one's $29.99 and it looks like sizes range from a small to a 2X. And then they have a Dapper Dan's t-shirt. I like the bow tie. Original Fab Four. Uh, I think this shirt is also $29.99 yeah. and the reason why I say that is because they have a little deal going on on the t-shirt so if the shirts are regularly $29.99 then um, you can get $25 you can get them for $25 each if you buy two and sizes range from a small to a 2x in this shirt and nothing on the back so it looks like they made an entire wall of the Joey shoe merchandise and there's a few new things like this denim jacket this thing's cool Here's a look at the front. Oh, this is gonna have some weight to it. It's got Walt and Mickey, the dog from Pirates, Chanta Tiki Room. Uh, let's see, this jacket is, I'm gonna say $99.99. $79.99. And it looks like they only have sizes medium, extra large, and extra, extra large. They also have this tumbler with the castle. These little like beads in there. That's cool. This tumbler is twenty-seven ninety-nine. All right, so I think for the most part it's basically for the Emporium. So I think now we're gonna cross the street, head to 20th Century Music Company, and check out the new pins. So cool to see all the Main Street vehicles passing by. The cast members waving. That's cool. Uh, I did look over at 20th Century Music Company, and it doesn't look like Millie's in today, sadly, but. Let's go over there anyways and check out the new pins. So here's a look at all the new pins for this week. They have an Oswald Fig pin. This one's $24.99. Then they have an uh, Hortensia. I always forget her name. This one's $24.99. They have this Chippendale Mystery Pack. This one's $24.99. And they have this Chippendale 2 Pack. 
This one's $44.99. I like this pin. Look at the blue. Chippendale. Right. This one's $19.99. Then they have this pin, which... Hold on. It's, it's like this, normally. So it, it like, it's like collapsible, I guess you can say. If you look carefully, they're all acorns. This pin is $24.99. Then I have this Best Buds pin, $19.99, and then lastly they have this Bambi Earth Day pin, $20.23. This one's $17.99. So I ended up coming inside of 20th Century Music Company because the customer was helping me outside said that there's a bunch of new open edition pins. And I want to say that this is probably one of them. How adorable is that? <laughs> this one's silver, which is $11.99. We also have this Dale pin. $11.99 and then they have this chip pin with the top of the acorn. $11.99 and then I'm sure there's a bunch of other new ones but I don't really look at the open editions too much so I haven't like remembered which ones are old or which ones are new. Although I saw this one and I am 100% sure that this BD1 pin is new. This one's yellow which is $14.99. So every week, every time we check out the pins, I always tell you which one of my favorite one was. And you guys are going to be surprised that it's none of the uh, limited edition ones. <laughs> I think my favorite pin of the day was probably that BD1 pin. So we ended up coming from Disney Clothiers, which there was nothing, so I didn't even bother filming in there. But over here in the China Closet, look, we have a new Enchanted Tiki Room mug. <laughs> this is so cool because it's ceramic, but it's like, it looks like it was like carved out of wood. This mug is $24.99. So there's two other items in here that look like they're new. I want to say it's this pillow. It's like I've never seen this before. I don't even know what the style is, but it has a bunch of the you know Disney characters. It's got Mickey, Milan, Simba, Grogu, Iron Man. This one's $34.99 for the pillow. Oh look, there's more characters on the back. Chewy's on there. It's cool. And then I think this is a lunch bag? Yeah. They have a lunch bag with the same like print on there. The lunch bag is $34.99. So after we finished with the China Closet, we ended up coming to Candy Palace and it looks like they have the same treats as last time I was here. I don't want to get too repetitive by showing you guys the same treats, but here's a quick pan of all the treats. But anyways, that's basically everything new I was able to find on Main Street. I think now we're going to check Tomorrowland. I'm a little surprised. I expected Tomorrowland to be a lot more like busier today. It's not though. So we just made our way inside of the Star Trader here in Tomorrowland and look. The 100 Celebration Lounge Fight ears are back in stock. I haven't seen them in any other store or on the park yet. Or on Main Street anyways. But they do have a ton over here at uh, the Star Trader. And these are $44.99 just in case you're wondering. But besides those uh, 100 Celebration ears being back in stock, that's basically it for the Star Trader. I couldn't find anything else new. So after we left the Star Trader, we ended up coming to Store Command, and they have two new plushes in stock. So let me show you guys Doug first. He's part of the, uh, I think the Cuddles line. I'm not mistaken. Yep, Cuddles. <laughs> that's so cool. I can smell you. I love Up. Uh, this one's... $39.99 and then they also have a new plush that goes with that Big Feet plush line. That's Kevin. They finally brought Kevin to the park. He has giant feet. Uh, looks, looks like Kevin is $29.99. Alright, so we just left Tomorrowland and sadly there wasn't a whole lot of new merchandise in Tomorrowland. Just Store Command which had those two new plushes and I think that was basically it. Um, hopefully we have better luck in other parts of the park, but if not, we're just going to head to World of Disney and see if there's anything new over there today. So we're heading to Frontierland, but we got stopped by some baby ducks. They're eating popcorn. Here comes Mama. She's like, back away from my children. And there they go. So I'm going to skip Pioneer Mercantile for now because I think the Disneyland band is out right here in front of the Golden Horseshoe. You can kind of hear them in the background like. Alright, we're going to go get a spot to view the band.
Sadly, they're done for now. They're actually uh, marching off right now. So we just made our way into the Pioneer Mercantile. And remember that merch I showed you guys inside of the China Closet? It was, a, it was a lunch bag and it was a pillow. Well, they have more stuff of that line in the store. So as soon as you walk into the store, you're greeted by all the new merch, Disney 100, and it's got all the characters in there. Like the whole thing, this whole thing is embroidered on there, which is nice. This is a nice sweater. It looks like it's cropped though, which is the only thing that sucks about this. <laughs> but besides that, it's a really cool sweater. This one is $64.99. Oh, focus, they go $64.99. And it looks like they have sizes extra small, extra large, 2X, and yeah, 2X is the biggest it looks like. And then they have the lunch bag, the pillow that I already showed you guys earlier. They have this kid's sweatshirt. Not a fan of like that peach color. And then they have a button-up shirt as well. They have a kid's t-shirt. And then they even have a backpack. Backpack is ah oh, doesn't say wait thirty nine ninety nine and then we're still on the same display but we're on the back side of it now and looks like they have some sleep pants sleep pants are thirty nine ninety nine and looks like they have sizes small medium large two X and three X and then lastly they have it's like a baby onesie onesie is nineteen ninety nine. So before we leave Pioneer Mercantile, I want to let you guys know that they have the Moana ears here. They have the Simba or Lion King ears, the, the one with Nala and Simba on there. And then they have the Enchanted Tiki Room ears here as well. See, so they have the Tiki Room, Lion King, Moana, Lion King. Ah, uh, look who's out right now. It's Tiana. And she's right in front of her place, which they're still working on. <laughs> so I think we're going to head to our last stop of the park anyways. We're gonna go to Pooh Corner, and then I think after that, we're gonna head to World of Disney. So I don't know if you guys remember this, but last time I was here, I showed you guys Critter Country, and it was like a ghost town. It is the complete opposite of that today. Critter Country is crazy busy. <laughs> Even Winnie the Pooh is at 35 minute wait, which is rare. Like that one's usually like a five minute wait in the mornings. So we just got inside of Pooh Corner, and I wanna say the only merchandise besides all the, sho the Joey shoe line that's new is probably the Stitch Spirit Jersey. Which is this one that i showed you guys at world of disney sometime last week i can't remember uh doesn't say how much it is but i'm gonna say it's 79.99 or 84.99 and just like always looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 2x and just in case you guys forgot what the front looks like here's the front all right guys so we're now on main street as you guys saw or like i mentioned there was not a lot going on inside of the poo corner so we ended up leaving i think now we're gonna leave the park all together and head to world of disney all right guys, we just got inside of World of Disney, and just like every store basically I've seen in the Disney Resort, looks like they have the Simba ears, these Simba ears, and then sadly nothing really new in the new emos. So right now, no new accessories or plushes, but they still have that deal going on, which 
seven dollars each when you buy three. Regularly twelve ninety nine. I think it means like the accessories well, and the outfits. Sure. They've also got the enchanted tiki room ears and a dress to match. I think it's a dress. Yeah, I think it's a dress. <laughs> so it's fifty four ninety nine, and it looks like sizes range from an extra small to a three X. They've also got that mug that I showed you guys at the channel closet earlier. They have a polo shirt. And then they have this button-up shirt, all themed to the Enchanted Tiki Room. And then over here in the Joey Shoe merchandise, looks like they have a new spirit jersey. This thing must be super popular because they only have extra smalls, two XLs, and then a couple of extra, extra larges. But look at this spirit jersey. Really cool, actually. And here's a look at the back. There's like glitter in the uh, puffy paint. And you got the castle in the back, Mickey Mini, Small World. This one's nice. And in case you're interested, this one's $79.99. And then here, room three, looks like they have a new Oswald sweater. This one's actually pretty cool. Really thick too, so this is gonna for sure keep you warm. Probably not the best thing to buy for the weather right now because it's kind of warm today, but it is nice though. Here's a look at the back. Looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 2X. And in case you're interested, this one's $64.99. So if you're a fan or if you like collect all the, the shoulder plushes that they sell here at the parks or at the Disneyland Resort, we're gonna be happy about the new one. The new one is Abu. Look at that. This one's too cool. Uh, doesn't say how much it is on there, but let me see if it's posted where, where this is located. And it is, looks like it's $22.99. So now uh, we're on that wall between room four and room five, and it looks like they have a new last bag. This one's themed to Encanto. Being strong is fabulous. It's kind of nice. I like the dark blue. Here's a look at the back. And then I'm really interested to see what the inside looks like. Uh, let's see. Oops, you guys look at the inside. It's okay. This launch fight is $88. So I wanted to show you guys the wall of Magic Bands, but there's a lot of people over there right now. But I did look over it and I didn't see any new Magic Bands in there. And as far as the mug wall goes, it doesn't look like there's anything new on here, but it looks like the newest mug that did have a World of Disney was that Enchanted Tiki Room one. But that's basically it for World of Disney. Well, we just have World of Disney. That was basically everything I was able to find in this store and around the park. But anyways, I think I'm going to end the video here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.